Okay, now that we applied the roll down method, the next method is known as the spray gun method. I'm gonna take this film and apply it to this screen using the spray gun. This is a typical spray gun you'd have if you're painting a car. What's important, number one, is you just have water in this canister and it be set between 30 and 40 pounds of air pressure. Now the first step is to put what's known as a light tack coat on the screen. You notice I have this screen facing print side out. I'll put a light tack coat on. Set this gun down for a second. Take my film, which I already cut. Turn it over and you can see it's barely in place. Matter of fact, I could pull it off right now if I wanted to. See that? This tack coat is just holding it in place. Now, what I do is with this spray gun, now I apply on the print or squeegee side. Until I get a nice gloss. It's almost like a mirror image right now. I'll set this aside. Take a window squeegee. All right, this is now ready to be dried. I'll put it in my drying cabinet. Once it's dry, I expose it. That's all there is to it. All right, now that I've got this applied, I have to dry it. I'm gonna dry it in this cabinet. And the cabinet's set for 110 degrees Fahrenheit. It should be drying about a half an hour to an hour. At that point, then I'm gonna check the screen. Okay, let's see if it's dry. Now capillary film will let you know when it's ready to go. What you do is you just pick at the corner. Hear that noise? It means capillary film is not ready. That means put it back and dry it a little bit longer. Once the screen is dry, that film will remove nice and easy with no noise. When that happens, now you're ready to expose the screen. Now that the screen's dry, next thing is mount your positive on your screen and expose it. So I'll just put it in the exposure unit, set my time. I got 100 and 180 units, and I'm gonna close it down. Okay, it's now exposed. Vacuum's gone. Open it up. Remove my positive. And bring this into the washout area and develop it out. Okay, I'm ready to go. Wet the screen down. You can wait 30 seconds to a minute to wash this out, but I like to wash it out right away. While this is developing, it's a good idea if you have a washout sink, make sure you have some good ventilation. It's always good to have good air with you. Other thing I'd like you to notice is I'm doing most of my washout on the print side of the screen. Capillary film, being it's only on one side of the screen, wash out on the print side most of the time. However, you can do a little bit of a rinse job on the squeegee side. Now the important thing is rinse the squeegee side off. That's it. Now you're ready to dry it and then print.